everyone. Thank you so much for checking out Crafty Little Rosebud here on YouTube. Today I've got a little haul for you all. Um, it's not big. I was just super excited to open these two orders that I've got. So I want to go ahead and jump on here and share those with you. I will post links down in the description below um, to these two shops. And then I also have um, my PR codes and um, discount links down there as well as links to my social media. So both of these shops are new to me. I don't think they're new shops, but new to me for sure. I've got an order here from Chasing Chells and then one here from uh, Starfish and Frog. So first things first, we'll jump into the Chasing Chells one. Um, I believe this was off of the website. I don't remember if she has an Etsy or not. Um, I'll definitely link the website. If she has an Etsy, I'll try to link that too, if I remember. Um, so it looks like we've got a little um, card here. Um, I guess she does a point system. So we've got a little freebie sheet of some functional little boxes and such there. And then it looks like she's got a point system where you collect the logos and you get um, $15 shop credit. So I'll hold on to that. And then it looks like there's some extra little freebies from Daily Cuteness. Um, a Chasing Chells freebie here, very functional and beautiful florals. Um, planning with Jazz. And then into my order, I got these little characters. Um, can't remember what her name was. Oh, I guess she's just called Chells. And so I grabbed some of them. I've got the school one here. The self-care, which I do not implement enough, but I'm hoping having this cute little sheet will encourage me to. Um, I got the fall one. And let's see, winter, which again, I got to put a lot of these aside for the end of 2019, but that's fine. Um, plan, so you've got little happy mail ones, actually planning on a desk. And I really like these mix sheets. I thought they were so cute and just perfect to have a variety. Um, fast food, which I don't eat often, so I thought just having a few of each would be great. Spring, and we have been having so much rain. It's not even spring yet, but so much rain. Um, let's see, celebrate. So you've got birthdays, weddings, graduation. Summer, and I have some of these um, character sheets already, or stickers already from another shop, but I really like them, so I picked this one up as well. Um, breakfast. Dramatic. I just thought this was funny because my daughter's just turned two, and I call her my teenager, and I thought this would be funny in my memory planner for... Um, adding a little picture on the days I make note of her meltdowns. They haven't gotten too bad yet, but cooking. And then sleep because my daughter does go through sleep regression occasionally and I'm exhausted. And then other times she sleeps great. So I just thought those were cute. And what actually drew me to even go to the shop was that she sells these kits with foil overlays. So here is the kit that I picked and you get to pick whatever month you want. I don't even remember what month I picked right now. Um, but you got your functional page here, you had your washi page, and then you've got some full boxes here and some headers. And I picked February, which is already over, but um, it's my birth month, so I thought that would be cute. It's also my daughter's birth month. So I like to do a little bit of special decoration for February. And then it's got these foil overlays here. So you've got your date dots, your corners. Um, these are actually um, headers, it looks like. And then um, you've got your days of the week, uh, week, rescheduled, canceled, and notes. And then you've got some foiled icons here. And um, I did it in rose gold. I think you had the option of which foiling you want, but I could be wrong. So that's actually what got me to check out her shop was I saw that on her Instagram and then um, I found the cute little characters and got them as well. 
Then next, um, this is Starfish and Frog. I do not have a Hobonichi Weeks. I am not getting a Hobonichi Weeks, but they had a bunch on sale. And since it was a shop I never checked out before, I went ahead and picked this up and I thought these would be good in my mini happy planner. So here's a little extra sheet with some boxes. Here is one of the Hobonichi pages. And I gra uh, grabbed this one because I liked these florals here. And then here's a really functional sheet. And like I said, these will just work so nicely in the mini happy planner, I think. And they were such a good price. I figured why not try them out. Plus it was a shop I'd never tried out before. So I definitely wanted to check out the shop. So, and they're similar layouts. Um, just the colorways change on some. And I definitely like the paper and I like the colors, so I'll definitely be checking them out. Um, first, I just need to try some of these out and see if I like how they go in my mini. So that is all that I got. I will link both shops below, and thank you so much for watching. Bye.